region has gone through an incredible transition over the last 20 years, this region meaning the, the federal contractors. Uh, we began delivering water out of the Central Valley Project south of the Delta in 1952. And from 1952 to 1989, we only had one year in which we weren't able to meet 100% of all of our contractors' needs. And, um, and now we have, uh, uh, on average, about a 50 to 55% supply uh, for the ag service contractors in the region. And, and generally, that's, that's evolved over the last 20 years as a result of implementation of three federal statutes. One would be uh, the Clean Water Act and, the, and, the, and pay delta standards under the Clean Water Act. Uh, the second would be the Central Valley Project Improvement Act, and essentially that uh, uh, restored Trinity River, dedicated 800,000 acre feet to the environment, and also allocated uh, for wildlife refuges, including uh, grasslands and, uh, and the federal and state refuges. And, uh, and then last but not least, the, uh, we have two listings that uh, affect our operations under the Endangered Species Act, the Delta smelt and uh, the winter run salmon. And so as a result of that, uh, generally th th this area has changed fundamentally in the amount of water that's available and the price that it's available for. So what, what have these folks done to, uh, to, to, to uh, try to adapt to, to reduce water supplies on an ongoing basis? Uh, generally, the first thing they did was went out and invested, if they could get the capital, they went out and invested in, in, in high-tech irrigation. And uh, it, it is very, very common for this region uh, to see uh, drip irrigation, not just on permanent crops, that's a, that's a given, but also row crops. And really, um, I, think, I think an econo economist from Berkeley, said, David Sunday, said it best, there, there really isn't any region anywhere in the world that actually produces more with less water than the west side of the San Joaquin Valley. It's, it really is incredible, and you'll see some of that irrigation technology as you look at some of the drainage impaired areas and, and once you get down into Westlands as well.